All right. I'll show you guys how to make protein pancakes. So what I use, I use two eggs, vanilla whey protein, uh, vanilla Greek yogurt, a little bit of egg whites, and oats. I'm going to see if I can do this with one hand. And I use a skillet. I'm putting it on about uh, 350 degrees. To start it off, I go ahead and put the eggs. Put two eggs in there. Let's see how well I can accomplish this with one hand. Yep, that worked that well. I'll go ahead and make it, put another one in. Okay, two eggs. I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and put three scoops of oats in. Just a normal spoon. Not real specific. Go ahead and take a little bit of egg white. Just gonna drip a little bit in there, just like that. Boom. Go ahead and get a couple scoops of Greek yogurt. Let's probably put about three, four scoops in there. Should probably invest in a tripod. Anyways, and lastly. Let me go ahead and put in a scoop of vanilla protein. Doesn't really matter what brand or anything like that. Go ahead and put that in. And go ahead and stir it up. It'll be a nice, pretty thin mix. It won't be that. Won't be too ridiculously thick. It's not gonna be like normal pancake batter. But it'll be a little bit different. A little bit more runny in my opinion. I stir that up. Once you get that stirred up, make sure your skillet's on about 350 or 400. For me, I spray this every time. Every time I put a new pancake on. Go ahead and do that. Go ahead. Just pour the pancake mix on. Or the yeah, that'll work. Let's see how this works out. Go ahead and put it there. Take a normal pancake. One in this corner. Now these are gonna be pretty thin. Not gonna be all that thick like normal buttermilk pancakes. Put that there. So a normal serving should make you about I would say five big pancakes. So go ahead and let those cook up. For a couple of minutes I'll show you guys what I put on them. So they didn't have any sugar free, but I put the Hershey's Light on here, which seems to work really well. So let's see how I can flip pancakes with one hand. Anyways, I put it out at the, I put it out the 400 if I have it on there. Some of this stuff. All these cooks just like to see, just like normal pancakes, just like to see bubbles in there. A few bubbles. Go ahead and flip them, check them a little bit. I'm just gonna make these for for show you guys as an example what to do. Get this plate out. Don't really think it's time to check them yet, but. Yeah, still need, still need a little bit of time. Not too much. Like I said, they're not thick, so they don't need a whole lot of time. Yeah, not done yet. This one will be interesting. Trying to get that flipped. You don't want to make these two close together like I did. 
or else it'd be a little bit difficult making the pancakes. <laughs> it's a horrible job flipping there. It's a decent flip. Try to put this on there. I'm gonna flip those over and just keep making them like, keep letting them cook do a better job than I did. You guys will be alright. So you don't gotta wait too long. Not too long at all. So you could probably flip them back over. Maybe one more time if you really want to. Make sure they're cooking okay. Yeah, I'm definitely not a YouTuber. Just putting this more, on, more or less on here for my brother. Show him how I make these. So there you go. This is what the pancake should look like. That'll be pretty thin. Cooked like that on that side. Go ahead and see how this one's doing. Yep. Just like that. Put that over there. See what's going on with this one. Just as good. And lastly, the one I messed up. So go ahead and put that out there. What I do is use this Hershey's Light. Dump it on top of it. Not too much, but just a little bit. And there you go.